The second phase of clinical trials for nanocovax has proven the vaccine's immunogenicity. During the second stage of human trials to test the domestically produced vaccine, volunteers were vaccinated at the Hanoi-based Military Medical University and the Pasteur Institute in Ho Chi Minh City. Initial results proved the vaccine's safety and efficacy. Vietnamese scientists are speeding up the clinical trials of the nanocovax. In the third phase of the vaccine's clinical trials, we'll test on 10,000 people, of which 5,000 people are expected to receive AstraZeneca vaccine shots, while the remaining 5,000 are expected to receive nanocovax shots. Based on the results, we'll compare the two vaccines in terms of unexpected side effects and antiviral efficiency. I believe that Vietnam will be able to produce its own COVID-19 vaccine. The administration of the second jabs of this phase is expected to be completed by the end of April. By the end of June and early July, we will have submitted the preliminary test results to the National Council for Ethics in Biomedical Research for approval of the third phase. I hope the vaccine will be licensed and approved for general use. Nanocovax, developed by the Nanochain Pharmaceutical Biotechnology Company, is Vietnam's first vaccine candidate to reach the human trial stage. All volunteers who got the jabs have been able to generate a host of antibodies that protect them from several newly mutated strains of coronavirus. As vaccines are being administered to people around the world, the story of when and how to safely return to international tourism is now in place. A seminar called Vaccines a Passport, the solution to safe tourism took place in Fukuok of Kinzang province. The event gathered together industry insiders such as regulatory agencies and businesses. Here they discuss multi-dimensional information about vaccine passports and agree that Vietnam needs to prepare for this option and be ready for when the vaccine passport is widely applied. A vaccine passport is actually a certificate that says that a person has had two doses of the COVID-19 vaccine and allows its holder not to be isolated or tested for COVID-19. Previously, the Prime Minister asked relevant ministries and agencies to review and gradually reopen international routes and draft plans to apply for a vaccine passport.